the arch you see above me are the arches we use to build bridges. You can build bridges like this in less than two weeks. That's a highway bridge, two lane, then including taking the existing bridge out and then installing these arches. These arches that you see up here come in a backpack. That's why we call it the bridge in a backpack. Uh, they, co they come in a, in a University of Maine hockey bag. Right behind me, there's a 40 foot span uh, arch in a hockey bag and, and one person can carry it and I'll demonstrate that. So, so this is a, uh, this, this right here is a 40 foot arch uh, in, a, in, a, in a hockey bag. And then to build the bridge, a two-lane bridge, you need about 12 to 15 of these, and you fill them full of concrete on site. You pump concrete in, there's a hole on top of each arch. You pump concrete in, and then the concrete fills the arch. You put a corrugated composite decking on top, backfill with sand, and pave the bridge. I'm happy to, to announce that through all the support from, from the Composite Center of the University of Maine and with Maine DOT's push for innovation and solution solving, uh, within the industry, we found a partner in Terra Arme. We have signed a definitive sales, marketing, and distribution agreement with them for helping us sell, market, and distribute this product in the United States, beginning in the United States, and in Canada. The foundation of this lies with the Composite Center, University of Maine, where most of the R&D was accomplished was then taken by AIT, who basically proved the commercial viability. We really look forward to taking this product to market, achieving good market success, participating further in uh, maybe some cost competitive uh, R&D programs for, to make, basically make the product more competitive. Uh, we know we can get in the door, we need to be competitive in the end. We've been replacing bridges through, through Bangor, the overpasses. Those bridges were only 50 plus years old. That's it. We cannot afford to do that anymore. We have to build our bridges to last 80 to 125 years. We can't be replacing bridges every 50 years. And so partnerships, innovation is the way we need to go. We're working on a whole bunch of fronts with the University of Maine. We work with the Civil Engineer Department on many things. We work with the Composite Center on many things. And we're going to continue to do that.